Um, just in advance, I apologize if my pants fall down. I couldn't find my belt today. <laughs> <laughs> get bigger and bigger as the day goes on. Um, okay. Uh, growing up, I played lots of sports since I probably started soccer, like most kids, like six years old or something like that. Uh, I played, played soccer, I played volleyball. I don't wear cool uniforms like that. I'm a big basketball. <laughs> um, I was in track since grade six is mandatory, I think. And then, yeah, um, I played ping pong, I played tennis, I swim, I uh, played lots of rec, floor hockey and stuff like that, just pretty much anything that's active. Um, in grade nine, I was playing um, a basketball team, a volleyball team, and a soccer team at the same time because I was on a club volleyball team, school basketball team, and a rec soccer team. And um, that wore down my knees really bad, and eventually I got, they started getting really sore, so I started talking to some doctors and stuff, and they sort of diagnosed me with um, patellar tendonitis. Not exactly, but pretty similar to that. Um, okay, yeah, that's, uh, it's also called jumper's knees, so for volleyball, lots of volleyball players get that. It's, uh, Inflammation in your knee, in your, your patella is your kneecap, for those of you that don't know that, and it's the inflammation right about here, so it's just, basically it's really, really sore when you try and bend over, and you try and jump, or run, or walk, or anything like that. Um, so I started going to physio for half a year, about, and nothing was really working. Plus I didn't do my stretches, because I'm really bad at doing stuff by myself at home. My homework is the same thing. Um, <laughs> so I decided I had to quit some sports because the doctor said that the only way for me to heal was to not do anything. So I quit basketball after grade 10. I played, yeah, I played grade 10 and I quit after that. And I quit track because it wasn't mandatory anymore. So I just decided to quit that. Um, yeah. So um, I, And I was in a soccer game for like an all-star game and I lived in Brooks, so it was in Medicine Hat and this one really tall, probably like 200 pound kid, he came up and he hit his knee like right above my, my good knee that was still good at the time and then, so now my other wrecked, so my other knee's wrecked, they're both bad. Okay, my second issue that I have with my body, <laughs> that's what my topic is, um, is <laughs> ITP. <laughs> which is that, I don't know how to pronounce that. Idiopathic fibrosis, something, something like that. <laughs> yeah. um, basically that is my platelets. You have white blood cells, red blood cells, and you have platelets in your body. So my platelets are somehow being killed off and they don't know why. That's what the term means. Um, my spleen is in charge of the killing of platelets. It's uh, creating antibodies that <laughs> kill your platelets because, I don't know, something's just going wrong. So um, I've been, I found out about my blood problem when I started getting nosebleeds for like four to six hours. Um, I would almost faint. I had to go to the hospital for two of them. I got some cottony kind of Thing shoved up my nose, similar to a tampon. It wasn't a tampon. It just sucked up blood, and it went up like this far. Like, if you put your finger up your nose, you guys could all do that. It just, just <laughs> and that times about two, and uh, it got, it just held the blood in there for like 48 hours, and they pulled it out. And it was probably the worst pain of my life. Um, so basically, I have to uh, get my spleen taken out, and. They had to do a bone marrow biopsy before that. I should have looked up after this is done. Okay. Okay. Um, they, uh, I got a bone marrow biopsy done last Friday, and mm -hmm. they basically took some bone marrow out to check if um, for some diseases like leukemia and other things, just in case that was another issue for my platelets. And. Yeah, so those are issues with my body.
when we fall. I don't know if that's going to work. Okay, while you're getting that ready, can we tell you some strengths? What else for strengths? I'm actually going to tell you. I'm 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 going to tell you. I